Is it up closer? Or should I be in the shade? Oh, hey. I didn't see you guys there. <laughs> I almost just cut my freaking finger off. Action teleprompter on. Jerry, LED lights on the teleprompter next time. Two, one, go. Hello, welcome ladies and gentlemen. No ladies watch my videos. So welcome gentlemen. We got a box to unbox. Dream Glove, they freaking up their game. They have personalized boxes now. Jerry, I'm gonna need to know that, that font. What are you thinking? You thinking that's a Vampire Wars font? That's what that looks like. CC Monster, <laughs> CC Monster Mash, bold. Uh, okay, hey, Dream Glove. We got uh, two customized Dream Gloves. I posted these on my story the other day. They got customized Dream Glove Company tape now. What are they, Amazon of glove companies? Rawlings, do you guys have that? Don't think so, probably. I don't know. Oh man, bro, remember I was just saying, hey, does Dream Glove have hats? If you're a bald person like me, be careful with wearing these because you'll get a lot of weird sunburn area things. Dream Glove hooked it up once again for 2023 customized gloves. I got two gloves this year and I kind of went all out. So for those of you guys who don't know, I'm not playing a regular season for the first time in a while during the summer. I figured it was a great time to go all out on my custom because I didn't have to worry about any umpires telling me I can't throw with these gloves. So what you're about to see from these customized dream gloves is pure beauty. Thank you for the, uh, the glove bags, by the way, Kurt. Appreciate these, these are awesome. So first glove, I went with a, a little cotton candy mix and oh my gosh, I went back to my iWeb roots because athlete first. But here's the twist on the, the cotton candy. Most times, looking at you, Willie Rios, you would go baby blue with pink, but you wouldn't mix in a scarlet red because that's not really in cotton candy, but I did. This thing's super sick because it makes a lot of really bright, loud colorways that I think exemplifies, if that's a word, I think. Exemplifies is a word, right? Exemplifies my personality. So you can see the light blue pink ratio. It plays really well in with the light blue laces mixing into the scarlet webbing. And I went pink on the text. You can even see my lips right there are the same color pink as the glove. So it all is correlated. I also got, for some random reason, don't know why, I got a California flag on the index finger. Dope, snake skin all around. As you know, the Robbie Rowe Show text in pink. And we're looking at a 12 and a quarter, 12.25. I usually go straight up one out in this. And I will say anyone who's looking to purchase a dream glove, I would encourage you to go like a half size bigger than you would typically go with your gloves because usually your hand will kind of get restricted within the size. So like if you're getting 11 three quarter, usually I'd go at 12 because it'll fit your hand a little bit better. But this one, 12 and a quarter, I usually get like a 12. So that's why I would say go a size bigger. I actually really like this. I would never be able to use this in a game, but I really like the colorway scheme of the pink meeting the red trim, meeting the baby blue laces. That's cool. Dream Glove Co. at Robbie Row one two. Dope. I'll put that there. Next one. This is one of the most personalized gloves that I've ever personalized, customized, eyesed in my life. Check this out. Yeah. Yeah, you're gonna wanna zoom pretty, pretty aggressively on that one. Dream Glove did it. I asked them if they had any way of doing a Vulcan kind of emoji. I didn't know how it was gonna turn out. I think that's perfectly fine. Even though it's not exactly the, the Vulcan emoji, I think if you were to look at this, you would connect the dots pretty dang quick. I also went super freaking dope on the text scheme because I went Cheddar Bob on the thumb I went discount code Robbie, that's me, on the index finger, bangerangs on the middle finger, and then the Vulcan with the freaking logo emoji thing again on the ring. So we have it thumb, ring, and my logo is on the web. That's sick. This is a 13 inch glove. And I went 13 inches because I was like, if I'm putting all these freaking logos and all these names on it, I need a lot of space, but actually it kind of fits kind of money. The only thing with 13s I've noticed, or the bigger the glove is, the thing I notice is the fingers want to cave inwards. The web kind of wants to cave inwards, but I am just a huge fan of this closed back web. And I went snakeskin all around, but the red and tan combo, sneaky freaking dope, right? 
And black on the inside. That's hot, black trim. And I think my logo looks better the bigger it is. Because that one's small, but that one's big. Chow, what do you think? I think you look good anyway. I think the bigger one looks like more me though, right? Yeah. Yeah, because sure. you can actually see the eyes. You know what's cool, and I just noticed this? The different color of my lips on this one to match the glove tone. The beard too. And the beard difference color on this one to match more of the tone of this. This is like, I would yeah. say like Darth Sith Lord, like, you know, coming back from the pit and freaking wielding the little dual lightsaber. And this one's like a new hope, you know, like, oh, the Jedi, they're coming back. We have something to hope for. Uh, so yeah, Dream Glove, once again, they're doing it. You guys, yeah, man. I mean, not only is it just dope to customize, like have full customization ability of your gloves to showcase your creativity and your personality, but when you're doing it on gloves that actually are like legitimate good leather, it's, you can't beat it, man. And for the price point, you just really can't beat it. Like I don't have a dream glove to date that I can't use because it's like all jacked up or it's all like loose or like whatever the case, like every glove that I've ever gotten from dream glove, like I still use to this day because I believe in the quality of leather, but that's what I got. Discount code Robbie. If you want to purchase your dream glove, hit me up. If you have any questions about them, I can showcase how I go about breaking in my gloves as well. I have a couple videos on that. The snake skin is always tricky to break in because I'm a water method guy. And with the snake skin, you don't want to get it too much of a water because then it'll just get really heavy and then actually get really, really loose quick. So you gotta be careful. I typically do more of a sponge tactic. I can show you guys that in a recent video. I'll even update the link at the end so you guys can watch that. All right, that's what we got. So, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. you're gonna like that. You're gonna like the way you look, I guarantee. You. I've never had a pink inside before. Are you getting this vasculinity or is that just, is that just, just hanging out? And, all right, thank you uh, Harmless Concept for filming this as a, we call him Steady Hand Harmless back where I'm from. <laughs> I think nice. if I would have got, like, cause I'm a big iWeb guy, but I love no, this clothes this back. Nice, dude. I love this clothes back. I didn't even back. know they put your logo on here too. And well, picture. full customization, bro. But I was thinking with this color scheme, how dope would it be if we had a closed back web, oh. like, a, like a neon yellow, just something totally different than the whole glove. But I like how they changed Man. your beard too. And I know. The, the lips right here to mix with this stuff. Did you just look at my lips? 